All right, hello everybody and welcome to a brand new What Is Next. Today we're going to talk about runes reforged, but I got to go fast because I want to tell you about all the runes, what they are, what they do, so at least you know, and that is it. We're going to try to do it in under 10 minutes and the video in the title, I'll tell you whether or not I accomplished that. Okay, so this here's how this is going to work. I'm going to say keystones for something. Everything I say until I say keystones for another tree are going to be for that specific tree. All right, follow. We've got a lot. Got to go quickly. Let's go. Keystones for precision. Press the attack. After three hits, you do bonus damage, and the enemy takes more damage from allies for six seconds. Lethal tempo. Hit someone. Wait a second and a half. Now you attack really fast. Fleet footwork. Pretty much what Warlords is now. Greater runes. Overheal. Bloodthirster's passive. Triumph. Takes downs. Give you 15% health and 25 gold extra. Presence of mind. If you level or get a takedown, mana costs are free for five seconds. Just some runes. These are all called legend with a subtitle, so I'm just going to give you the subtitle. Alacrity. Takedowns on enemies give you permanent attack speed. Tenacity. Takedowns give you permanent tenacity. <laughs> Didn't see that one coming. Bloodline. Takedowns equal lifesteal. More runes for this. The Coupe de Grace. Pretty much merciless in the middle tree right now. Cut down. Pretty much giant slayer. Last stand. This already exists. Don't know where it is, but you do more damage when you're low on health. All right, keystones for domination, electrocute. It's pretty much Thunderlords, but you have to use separate things for the three. Predator, tier three boots, but more damage. Dark Harvest, Thresh Souls, but with damage instead of armor. Greater Runes, Cheap Shot, deal bonus true damage to impaired enemies. Taste of Blood, Lifesteal for all damage. Sudden Impact, Magic Pen and Lethality for when you move quickly, teleport, or leave stealth. That's a little bit... You might want to look into that one. Runes, <laughs> zombie ward, kill a ward, get a ward. Ghost Poro, enter a bush, get vision for that bush. Eyeball collection, kill a ward or get a takedown, get AD or AP. Adaptive, so that means depending on how you're building. More runes. Ravenous Hunter, unique takedowns give you healing from ability damage. Ingenious Hunter, unique takedowns give active item CDR, including trickets. Relentless Hunter, unique takedowns give permanent out of combat movement speed. Moving to sorcery keystones. Summon Airy deals additional damage to enemies or shield allies when sent by attacks or abilities. Arcane Comet, hit an enemy with ability, send a comet to where the enemy is when they're hurt. Phase Rush, like a new Thunderlords, like new Thunderlords to proc, but the proc is movement speed instead. Greater Runes, nullifying orb. If you get low by magic damage, get a magic damage shield. Boom. Mana Flow <laughs> Band. Every so often you get an abilities cost refunded and get some mana or energy back. Kind of like Zareth's thing right now. The ultimate hat. Your cooldown on your alt gets reduced, and every time you cast your alt, the cooldown goes down even more. Some runes. Transcendence. Get 10% CDR at level 10, and any more CDR past the cap gets turned into AP or AD adaptive, like we were talking about earlier. Celerity. Get 4% movement speed and get bonus AP or AD adaptive based on your bonus movement speed. Absolute focus. While above 70% health, gain bonus adaptive damage. Some more runes. Scorch. Burn on an ability every 20 seconds. Water walking. Gain bonus movement speed and adaptive AD or AP in the river. Gathering storm. Gain adaptive AD or AP as the game goes on. This stacks a lot. Alright, resolve keystones. Grasp of the undying. Every four seconds when you do damage an enemy, do bonus magic damage, heal yourself, and gain permanent health. Basically the same, except you also gain permanent health. Aftershock, it's like Courage of the Colossus, Colossus, but you get some adaptive damage after the shield. Guardian, allies you target with spells, or ones that are really, really close are guarded <laughs> champions. And you get a shield and some brief movement speed when damaged for those guarded champions. Greater runes, unflinching, gain tenacity and slow resist for using summoner spells and having them on cooldown. Demolish. Become the Rift Herald, but probably not as much damage, I would assume. Font of Life. Mark enemies by impairing movement. If attacked by an ally, the ally heals from the mark. Runes. Iron Skin, but plus 5 armor, and gives you 5% armor for a while when you're healed. Mirror Shell. Iron Skin, what we just talked about, but with MR. Conditioning. After 10 minutes, gain 8 armor and 8 MR, and then get 5% boost permanently. More runes from that tree. Overgrowth. Gain extra health when minions or monsters die near you. Revitalize. Heals and shields are 5% stronger and 15% stronger on low health targets. Second Wind. Basically, Tom Kench's Grey Health. 
Inspiration Keystones. Unsealed Spellbook. Get shards to change summoners in the game plus CDR on your summoner spells. Glacial Augment. First attack against a champion slows. Slowing a champion with an item shoots a freeze ray and makes a slow zone. Kleptomancy. First attack after an ability gains you gold and sometimes consumables. Greater Runes. Hextech Flash Traption. When flash is on cooldown, get a buffered flash. Biscuit Delivery. Get a biscuit every 3 minutes until 12 minutes. Biscuits pretty much work the same as they do now, except they also increase your maximum of mana. Perfect Timing. Gain a stopwatch. It's basically a one-time use Zonia's. Runes. Magic Footwear. That's the title. Sorry. Get free boots at 10 minutes, but you can't buy them any sooner unless you get takedowns. Then it's 30 seconds faster for each tag take down. Futures Market. You can go into debt to buy items. Minion Dematerializer. You get six killing. You get six of them. Killing a minion with the item gives bonus damage to that minion type for the entire game. More runes. Cosmic Insight is 5% CDR, CDR cap, item, and summoner CDR. Approach Velocity. Gain bonus movement speed to ally champions that are movement impaired or enemies that you, that you made movement impaired. Celestial Buddy. Gain 100 health for the game, but 10% less damage to champs and minions until 10 minutes. Whew. We did it before 10 minutes, a little sloppy, um, but now you know what the uh, new runes are in a very basic level. There you are. Uh, the basic structure for that is you're going to gain a keystone, a greater rune, a minor rune, or uh, just a rune, and then one another one of those other rune slots and then you get a second tree where you get a greater rune a rune and a more rune as i like to call them um so that's the video thank you so much for uh dealing with my fast talk i hope you found it somewhat informational and i appreciate you sticking around if you liked it feel free to hit that thumbs up if you did love it feel free to hit that subscribe button i'll be around and until my next video which is going to be my patch note video in a few hours have a good one